Art is life and life is art. So welcome to the House of Life, another exciting edition of Art House. I'm Melinda Akinlami and it promises to be an interesting edition. Now let me quickly take you through our lineup. We have an exhibition by the Black Heritage Artists. Then Yetunde Babaiko shows us where dance and photography meet and more. So sit back, relax and enjoy the ride. One eye sees, the other feels. Art is the only serious thing in the world, and the artist is the only person who is never serious. If you thought Picture Perfect was a stroll in the park, Yetunde Ayeni Babaiko will make you think again. For this latest project, she left the comfort of Camera Studios to interpret a new idea which meant spending two years in different nooks and crannies in Lagos and working with other creative minds, dancers. To capture the energy of Lagos life, photography and dance joined forces. The performers try to convey the emotion behind each piece and take direction from the woman behind the lens. All this movement and arrangement help one to better appreciate the final result, which Yechunde proudly shows off at the Wheat Baker in Lagos. About 25 images that tell nothing of the daily grind experienced while working on this celebration of Lagos, titled Eco Moves. It's a collaboration between me and SPAN. SPAN is a society of performing artists in Nigeria which is founded by Sarah Bulos. I met them, coincidentally, two years back, and I was fascinated by the dance and by their performance. And I decided to photograph them. And not just photograph them like in the studio or anything, but in different places of Lagos, different distinct places like Obalende, Makoko um, National Stadium, uh, Femikoti Shrine, you know, places that people know. and. It has been really uh, great and amazing. The first title that we chose was Lagos Dance. But I thought it was a bit flat. First of all, Lagos is known as Echo, and I love the word. It's just three letters and I just love that name. And moves because of the dancers, they are moving. And I think also in a deeper sense as well, I mean, we as a collaboration, we are moving, we are, we are um, changing something we are you know moving not moving mountains but at least we are uh, going to places we are showing people something else performance we are showing them um, entertainment and really at every place we have been i mean there were passerbys bystanders watching seeing what we are doing you know and we we showed them something that they don't see on a daily basis Babaiko challenged dancers with her lens at the market, motor parks, classrooms and other places in Lagos that capture one of the fastest growing sites in Africa. The first shots I start, I tried to get costumes for them, but it wasn't working. And we said, when I, I came up with the concept and I said, you know, easy is the best, you know, let's not just concentrate on costuming, it will take too much away from, from the essence, you know, let's do it simple, just wear whatever you're wearing or bring white clothes because white pants and the dresses, the ballerina dresses was, was a really nice contrast to the hustle and bustle in Lagos, so um, there was nothing, no drama, not even makeup, I wanted to sweat. Some of the works being exhibited include Obalende, 1, 2 and 3, Broad Street, Balogun Market, Education, 
to any Lagosian, the titles are all too familiar and certainly not a place a lady with a camera will get a grand reception. But she braved the odds. Everything has been going on quite smoothly and yeah, we have been to rough places like Balugu Market where it is crowded and people are watching and commentating and yeah, maybe they will have some area boys here and there, but they have been mostly friendly and um, the most challenging part might have been the, the research and the work that goes before any shoot. You can't, because you can't just pick up your camera and start going to those places and start shooting. You know, you have to make provisions and you have to, you know, know the areas where you are going and know the people. So I think the work before the shoot was quite tasking. With a lot of help from the Society for the Performing Arts of Nigeria, SPAN, Eco Moves shows both photographic and performance artistry.